Hello everyone, in this video I want to show you tuple in WPML. In previously other videos I have shown already how to install, how it works, uh, WPML. And now that it has tuple as a new translation integration, then it's even better the automatic translation of WPML. So if we go here to the translation management tab, the first time we will be asked to sign up for free and we can get up to 2000 credits each month. So you can just add your information. You will be charged $1 to activate, but it will be refunded. So you actually don't spend, but it's just part of the process. And this is a formula that we have to give the information in order that we have to advance. So I will show you here from my website. Once that you already sign up, you can add different types of languages. And the mainly ones that are with people are basically Dutch, English, French, German, Italian, Japanese, Polish, Portuguese, Russian, and Spanish. So every time if you go to the language mappings here on the translation tools, we will see which are the ones that are available to translate with Deeple. In case that you see an X here, you might have to use either Google or Microsoft automatic translation. So, but basically these are the languages that you can use with Deeple. And here you can see the table of the credits and how much you will have to pay. You can set up different amounts according to the credits that you might need. You can even establish a limit so that you can, uh, once you reach certain amount of credits, you don't pass over, but eventually you can go here to change them. Of course, if we go here to invoices, every invoice that you do or you have every month, you will can download here from Deeple. But going here to set up Deeple as a main automatic translation, we will have to set up for example here i'm stating that microsoft will be the first one then google but since tuple is the best automatic translation i prefer to turn off microsoft and google and keep tuple as a main translation source and basically this will be the the way that you will say to wpml that i want my automatic translation with tuple and I will show you just one example here on my posts. Let's go here. For example, I have the Italian. There are like, you will see here on your normal WordPress website. And you will here see the plus. And you can actually just click on setting the translation that you want. And for example, this will need 4,533 credits. So here you can see actually the engine that they will use and the credits available. So one recommendation that I do when using Deeple is that first you actually check all these sort of phrases that you want to keep the same. Also the URL slug. Uh, to keep it as you want in order to have your international SEO properly. Another recommendation that I do before going on the fully automatic translation is to go here, down. For example, if we have like phrases or words, we can just set it up and this will reduce the amount of credits. And another recommendation that I do either to save some credits is to download the tuple for Microsoft, because this will help you to have the exact same translation. And let me show you, because I will do here the trans automatic translation, spending some credits. And if we compare this text with this one is exactly the same. So if we go here to tuple, and you decide to download the Deeple for Windows, it's free. If you want some more type of feature, then you will have to pay for the, for the plan, different plans that they have. 
but downloading this one will be really helpful for some certain uh, amount of phrases or big paragraph. This is the things and tip that I give in order to save some credits and in order to to use credits in other um, in other posts that might be more worthwhile to use the automatic translation and this also is especially on saving you credits but it will take time but in order to use um, in order to save time then you will have to go here to the translate to the automatic translation and of course in just one click we will have the translation so we already spent around 4000 credits so this is the amount that we have left but as we have seen tipple translation it's pretty fast and it's even more accurate it's still a little bit mm, machine translated but it's even better and more uh, with the grammar it's even better so it's actually recommended and this is how simple it works tipple in wpml this is not a really complicated thing so this is the tip if you want to save some credits you can use the microsoft software of Deepool. this will help you to save some credits and if you need some automatic translation you can do it here or in case that also you need some bulk translation and even more faster translation we will go have to go back to the translation manager set up the different translation items and then send them to the box, to the basket, so that it's translated. So I, I hope that this video helped you to know a little bit more about Deepul WPML. Thanks for watching.